Hi, I'm Azelle from the upcoming Lovely to Speak to you today. Congratulations on this fantastic film. Um, can you tell us a little bit about it? What can viewers expect when they watch it? What can they expect when they watch it? Well, they can expect to be thrilled. Firstly, it's um, about a drag artist that gets um, attacked by a man in the closet. And basically, a few months later, um, the drag artist sees this man in a sauna and goes to an act of revenge. So I think. First off, it's a thriller, and they can be thrilled. It's really, really fast-paced. It doesn't really let up on that intensity. So I think, yeah, be thrilled. Can you tell us a little bit about your character, Jules? I mean, obviously, you're a drag queen, and, but mostly you're a bit of an outsider in this. Can you talk about stepping into that role and what was the kind of appeal for you? It was really hard, because I, I kind of approached it as, as three different characters. It was kind of like Jules as Jules is Jules, um, and then Jules as Aphrodite, um, the dra drag queen, and then Jules after that moment, and trying to ensnare Preston. Um, so it was it was kind of like three different hats and sometimes three different hats in one scene. So I kind of had all these like charts and colours and I like kind of really went through stuff. Um, that was kind of how I approached it. And then you just kind of tentatively go and you kind of trust and then just explore the scene with, you know, George is great. So. So can you talk about that working relationship with him, George, as Preston? What was that like? Amazing, amazing. I think we just really established something where we trusted each other, like the parameters. It was really hard what we were doing. It was really confronting and, and yeah, and, and really difficult with, with another actor to go through those motions, to go through those scenarios. So, yeah, we just kind of, we sat in this bit of trust. It was very immediate. I kind of, like the second time I met him, I basically threw myself on the couch. I was like, oh! So it was very immediate. We were really like, like we got in straight away. And obviously dressing up as a drag queen, that's a, quite a lengthy process, isn't it? I mean, how was that for you, transforming yourself into this character? It's weird because it, what it actually did, it, give, it kind of you actually are putting on the character. So even though you're like, it's taking a really long time, you can feel yourself changing as that's happening. You're like, okay, well, I can feel more like Aphrodite after the eyelashes go on or the nails or whatever that would be on that particular day. But it really, it really became part of the process. It wasn't just sitting in makeup for like, you know, a couple of hours. It really became part of something. And I had a playlist, which I looked at today. So one of the directors asked me about this playlist today. It's 12 hours long. <laughs> so I had this like really long playlist that I would listen to just, you know, for days and just kind of really get into it. It was, it was amazing. It just really informed the character. I mean, that's the film's partially about that, like how things inform you. So yeah. And I think obviously, I know it was a short and, and now it's developed into film, which kind of sits in its own right, really. So can you tell me what you hope viewers will take away when they watch this? The take away, what well, firstly, and I have been saying this quite a lot, but firstly, I really, really want people to be entertained. It's a film. I want them to be thrilled. I want them to not know what's going to happen next. I want them to be invested in, in the characters. And then after that, there are so many conversation points, there are so many things politically the film saying we have to talk about how people are maligned and attacked and discriminated against. But really, first and foremost, it's a, definitely a film. Oh, well, thank you so much for speaking to me. Enjoy your evening. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.